Hello, um, Shadow Banjo here. Um, I'm going to just give you guys a quick update um, on what I'm going to be doing in the next few, I don't know, months or whatever time I'm on here for. But um, I don't want to be making tutorials anymore. Reason being, or two reasons being, I give my vehicles out anyway for free. Um, so I don't really see any need to make tutorials and the second reason is my vehicles aren't the easiest to make they are quite complicated and it's quite a drag making tutorials for every single one so instead I'm going to stop making tutorials for my vehicles and I'm going to make a sort of regime sort of plan on how to give you guys the vehicles um, I'll sort out a timetable of some sort so you can know when I'm on or something so you can, you know, so it'll be a lot more organised um, what I'm planning on doing is showing you guys how to do some glitches on Banjo so making some vehicles, you know, how to make a rotating turret head how to make the hyperdrive glitch smaller, how to use foldy wings to get under the map, you know, these sort of glitches which people would like to know but can't find videos of on YouTube. So I'm going to contribute there. Um, also, I am thinking of making Halo Wars um, videos, you know, just tactics, so ev everyone can benefit from my experience on Halo Wars. I'm a general, by the way. Um, what I will do though is I will show you my new collection of Halo vehicles. I've been updating a lot of vehicles, making a lot of remakes. And um, here they are. So I'll start off with my new Hornet. It's um, a transport Hornet, so that's why it's silver. And that's why it doesn't have any missile launchers. It, it looks pretty good, I like it. It's one of my favourite vehicles in the moment, actually. Um, my Sparrowhawk, I've made a new one. It's got lots of panels and l panel -y sort of detail -y sort of stuff. Um, my Falcon. It is very big and chunky. Um, but I like it, it's very detailed. With these massive rotor blades on top. Don't even spin. And uh, <laughs> it has red lights inside. Which, uh, I, I like it. it. Looks, it gives it a good effect. Um, also, I have made a booster frame from Halo Legends, uh, the package episode. I think. Yeah. For those of you who've seen it, you will recognise this. It's sort of the space bike which the Spartans fly around in and poo in the nubs with. Uh, made a new grizzly tank. Um, it's massive. Very big. I haven't got the turret rotating yet. I will do it soon though. Um, I have got the rotating turret on this new scorpion though, which is pretty cool. The avalanche scorpion. That's why it's white. I don't like it in green. But no, my new vehicles don't really look well in green because they're so detailed, you know, the green just... Blech. Ooh, I've made a Cyclops. <laughs> yeah, Cyclops. It, it moves, but it doesn't really do much. Um, what else? I have made a Rocket for Dog. Okay, this is how it's made in the garage for you people who wanted to know. Um... I've made a vulture, which is very nice, I like it a lot. Um, I've also made a pelican, which is a lot more detailed. Um, also I have a new wolverine, in the same style as my warthog. So it acts as anti-air, unlike most um, Wolverines. Um, I also haven't shown you my 
and sometimes I didn't get to show it in my video. Don't know why, I just forgot about it completely. Uh, what else? Ooh, yeah, I made a new um, battle cruiser. Nice and raw. I made a locust, a new locust, which is a lot more, yeah, I don't know, it looks a lot more like a locust. Um, I've made a chopper, a new chopper. I know it has foldy wings. The only reason I put the foldy wings on now is for the two by one bit at the bottom. You know, it looks good when you're outside of the garage. Um... Also, got a revenant. Um, yeah, my revenant from Halo Reach. Well, I'm going to go My Spectre. Yeah, which is off, I don't know, Halo 1 or Halo 2. I think it might be off both. Spirit, oh yes, my spirit. It's actually a dropship now. <laughs> it's not just a simple little shape, it's actually a dropship now. It has um, space in there. So if, you, if I take the wings away, you can see that there's space in there for little banjos. Um, Oh yes, I've um, been making, I made some Halo weapons, uh, as a Magnum, Assault Rifle, Battle Rifle, Plasma Rifle, Spartan Laser, <laughs> a Rocket Launcher, um, an Energy Sword, a Brute Spiker, Gravity Hammer, which is cool, a Shotgun, a Fuel Rod, Plasma Pistol, um, a Brute Shot, a Beam Rifle, and a mauler. Um, <laughs> my favourite one is a gravity hammer. A lot. Of, it's a lot of fun to use. You just, in multiplayer, you know, just fly over with your big ass gravity hammer. You just use the gyroscope. It's funny what. Hulk smash! Oh. Oh. The MP didn't work, I don't know why. Didn't like to make that big bubbly sort of electro probey thing, so I'll do it again. Hulk smash! Boom! Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, I'll give that a few guys if you want it. Uh, I have. Oh, yeah, um. One of my friends modded this for me. It was a two part vehicle, but now he's put it into a one part. Um, I, I can't give this away, sorry, I'm not allowed. It's um, an, an agreement we have. Uh, what else? I have, I know I have something else to show you, but I can't think of it. Uh, oh, I showed you the spec, didn't I? Uh, made some v mini vehicles. Made a um, base things. Um, oh yeah, yeah, my drop pod. Um, uh, I will make one tutorial and this is that's gonna be the tutorial of the drop pod because it is quite, you know, complicated and people want to know how it works. It, actually, it's not that complicated. Yeah, I'll give you guys a tutorial of this. It's quite easy and um, it's really fun to use. Yeah, a lot of you have been asking, oh, how does that work? Oh, how do you do that? I will give it to you. Hold the tow bar and use the springs. And you jump out. Yep, so I'll see you guys later with a drop pod tutorial. Bye!